This is the story of a grasshopper. He fiddled all day. A wise aunt told him, Hey, don't you fiddle your life away. It's not always going to be summer. Persian goof. It's With bad lots one. of food all around. A long, a long you better time. give some mind to working in the United States. For the winter. Probably rolls around with the grasshopper. He stayed what can with you his do? fiddle, and when pressed, just do the right say fiddle dee. Just do. I was born right and played a fiddle. So obvious. I trust my fiddle. Some things are just well, take clearly, care of me. Clearly wrong. Then along came the winter and the cold snow blowing round. You could strain your ears and still not hear the haunting a moving sound of the grasshopper playing on his fiddle. A huge pressure wave initially Lord traveling at a speed greater than that of sound spreads out from the center of the explosion. Followed by winds at speeds transiently exceeding 500 miles an hour. The winds create a low pressure area as they move outward. Surrounding air rushes in, fanning the many fires started by the thermal radiation and initial blast damage. One can expect these kinds of fires for a radius of anywhere from 8 to 16 miles, depending on the megatonnage. Firestorms of this type, aside from Hiroshima, developed after a series of conventional air raids on Hamburg in 1943, Leipzig and Dresden. They produced temperatures estimated at 800 degrees centigrade, 1472 degrees Fahrenheit.